Hi, this is Scott Garibay, and today I want to talk about Vivek Ramaswamy, and I want to talk about why I absolutely love Vivek Ramaswamy's wrong opinions, uh, his wrong policy stances. All right, so what is Vivek Ramaswamy wrong? So first of all, just let's not get it twisted. I've talked about everything I love about him, all his right policies, but let's talk about his wrong policies, what he got wrong, okay? So first of all, what did he get wrong? Uh, he is wrong on Ukraine. He is wrong on Israel. Uh, he is wrong on um, making uh, college students uh, like take basically the test that the immigrants take. But why do I love his wrong policies, right? So let's get into this. I love Vivek Ramaswamy's wrong politics because I have learned that a man who is thoughtful and takes the time to um, to journey down the road of knowledge in an organized manner is incredibly valuable. So who, so where did I learn this? Well, it's Patrick Willem. Patrick Willem is a, um, he is a movie reviewer, all right? And uh, he does video essays on movie reviews. And uh, like his, um, he's done many of these. He has a great channel right here on YouTube. It's all free. You can watch it right now, right? And he is absolutely brilliant, but the most wrong person I have ever listened to. But right now, I've listened to him several times over the last few years, right? I've listened to many of his video edit essays on film, right? And But this year, I just locked in on his content and I'm listening to every single video he's ever done. Right? and listening to everything he has to say about film. And he's wrong about everything, everything. And the reason why is you can always, he, he actually says it himself. His opinions are old man shouting at a cloud. He's like, oh, we need to make good movies that are just like uh, Martin Scorsese's movies and these, these darn uh, Marvel movies. <laughs> like, and so you would think, okay, well, why would you listen to him? Everything he says is old man found, shouting at a cloud, right? He's wrong about everything. So he's either old man shouting at a cloud or, get this, he's pretentious NYU film student. He has no other opinions, right? But in order to state his opinion, he goes on a journey and he gathers information. And the information he gathers is tremendously valuable. And he says it in a concise way right? And he says it in a way that's logical and shows an incredible amount of thought, right? So he is brilliant, but he has a weak will. He has no ability to change his mind or to break out beyond his formulation, which is he is a, a pretentious NYU film student, right? Like, and he, like, and he's 20 years away from it and still can't break that mold. And he's also old man shouting at cloud, right? Like, and, and, and even he says, white old man shouting at a cloud. Like his opinions are so bog standard, mayo vanilla, not one to set me away from exactly what, you know, dated, useless opinion that Martin Scorsese would have, right? But his journey is incredible, right? And so the thing is, he has not, he's not ever to able, able to overcome his own emotional burden, right? He's emotionally attached to these wrong opinions he has, right? But when you see him work, when you see him journey, right? He's rocky, he always walks to the wrong destination, but he he wears the right shoes, right? He wears boots and he keeps them dry, right? And he has a walking stick and his pack is packed perfectly. He could stop and pull out, you know, the rations he needs for the intellectual journey he goes on. And watching his process, to get to the wrong point is invaluable, invaluable. And that's why I trust Vivek Ramaswamy. He does not have all the right policy standards, right? He has many policy stances that are ridiculously wrong, 180 degrees away from what I believe, right? But he's a thoughtful man. He's a man of good character. That's another one, right? Uh, Patrick Willem is a kind man, a good man, right? And you could tell it from his speech, you know, like watch Chris Rock's last special. He is a repugnant, horrible monster human. It's right there in his special, right? Like, but Patrick Willem, you know, over watching many, many, he, he talks, he, he puts his mom and dad in his video. Like he, he's a kind, caring person. 
and his and the way he intellectually journeys is invaluable. It's the same as Vivek Ramaswamy. Vivek Ramaswamy goes on an intellectual journey. He thinks about each policy stance. He's not going to be a sit and sign president the way Donald Trump or President Biden will be. He's never going to sign a piece of paper that was put in front of him. He's going to read it and he's going to use the same intellectual process that Patrick Willem does to come. And he may come to the wrong answer, but he may come to the right. And at least we'll know there's a good person there making the point, right? Every single word of that is my humble opinion. What's important is when I get to hear your humble opinion, when you get in the comments and send your traffic, please consider like subscribing and have a wonderful millennium.